Hi, I'm Stephen Camilleri. I'm the CTO and co-founder of Speed3D. We're an Australian technology company that specializes in advanced 3D metal printing solutions. From very early in human history, people have been crafting things out of metal. We've come a long way from painstaking handcrafting to the power of industry level production. But let's face it, mass production has its downsides. It's costly, needs large scale operations, often needs to be shipped from the factory to the point of need. And for some applications, it's just not a good fit. Here at Speed3D, we think there's room for improvement. Sometimes it is just too hard to get the metal parts that you need. We're talking about something that is not just higher quality or more affordable or faster, but a better combination of all three. Our goal is to equip our customers with the advanced tech they need to handle challenges that mass production can't solve. Metal additive manufacturing, or AM, must have value. In this video, we're going to talk about what that value is and how it works. We believe that Metal AM should deliver a better way to get metal parts. We see a lot of potential in Metal AM, and we're going to explain why. We believe this method offers a smarter approach to creating metal parts, improving speed, part quality and affordability without sacrificing one or the other. Our Metal AM has changed the game when it comes to the production of complex metal parts. A big part of this is automation. The more automated the process, the less room for error. It makes everything more efficient and the results more consistent. If we automate things like toolpath development and design feasibility assessment, we not only get more reliable results, but we also save a lot of time. What has been missing from the discussion around AM has been a clear way to understand which kinds of AM deliver which level of automation. In this video, we'll present a scale we have developed to measure the automation level of different additive manufacturing technologies. We'll focus on things like toolpath development and how to assess if a design is feasible. Let's get started with the six automation levels. Level zero is manual machine programming. At this level, the toolpath is developed entirely by an operator. Level one is basic automatic toolpath generation from geometry. Here, software aids in toolpath development, but human intervention is still significant. Level two is simulation-based toolpath and predicted final geometry. The automation can simulate the printed part and its material properties. Level three is simulation, process constraint checking, and design suggestions. Automation can identify infeasible features and suggest design modifications. Human involvement is needed only for validation. Level four is automatic manufacturing, excluding quality and iteration. At this stage, the system can automatically modify the design to achieve feasibility, requiring minimal human intervention. Level five is hands-off, parts automatically produced and validated. The epitome of automation where the entire process is handled autonomously. Industry outsiders assume all of AM is already at this level, but as of 2023, this remains a theoretical goal for many in the industry. In the world of metal AM, laser powder bed fusion, LPBF, and directed energy deposition, DED, dominate. LPBF systems, which use a simple software complex hardware configuration, are generally at level one or two. DED has a few common forms, laser wire, laser powder, electron beam, wire arc, and cold spray. The advantage of DED is that it allows large parts to be built quickly. In our opinion, cold spray is the most promising DED process, as it is the fastest, the cheapest, with low thermal distortion and offers a wide range of material. However, despite DED's advantages, it is complex and usually demands weeks of expert setup. With few exceptions, all of DED is at automation level zero. Every new job takes weeks of expert setup. The process is unpredictable and the reliability is low. DED is a simple hardware and complex software configuration. But where's the software? The real benefits offered by DED cannot be realized without it. Speed3D is at the forefront of innovation in metal AM. We work tirelessly to incorporate high levels of automation into our technology. Currently, we're proud to say we're at level three on the scale. Our technology can process 3D geometries automatically, can reliably predict final geometry and material properties, identify infeasible features, and suggest modifications to the design. This means our process provides an impressive degree of automation, taking out uncertainty and rapidly compressing the amount of time to generate the parts that you need. 
our unique approach differs from other metal AM technologies. Speed 3D offers industry-leading levels of automation, meaning we offer the fastest way for you to get metal parts that other supply chains fail to deliver on demand. Speed 3D has the only cold spray AM technology in the industry that incorporates high-speed automation and CAD to part capabilities. Our process isn't just groundbreaking in terms of automation. It is a solid state, supersonic 3D deposition process, which means it's fast and affordable too. And with a focus on portability, we're able to bring our solutions directly to where they're needed most. This means you're not constrained by global supply chains. Instead, you're empowered to manage your own part inventory. To explore more about Speed 3D and our revolutionary metal additive manufacturing technology, drop by our website or reach out to us for a demonstration. We're excited to guide you into the future of additive manufacturing.